if we ask a person in this world to do us a favor or ask a person for some money, whether that person is a relative, a friend or someone we generally know, when we go up to that person the first time and ask to do a favor or ask for some money, that person will most probably do the favor for us or give us the money the first time. When we go up to that person the second time and ask for another favor or ask for more money, then that person will most probably also give the second time. But when we go up to that person the third time and ask for a favor or ask for some money, then that person will most probably say, how many times are you going to ask me? Did you know, brothers and sisters, that we have been blessed with a unique Lord? Our Lord, Allah the Almighty, is so unique that He likes it when we ask Him. In fact, the Prophet ﷺ mentions, مَن لَمْ يَسْأَلِ اللَّهِ يَغْضَبْ عَلَيْهِ Whoever does not ask Allah, Allah gets angry with him. So when we don't ask Allah, Allah becomes angry with us. This narration, it refers to that person who fails to invoke Allah whether it is out of disdain or whether it is out of pride. So we need to ask Allah the Almighty as much as possible to keep him happy. That is why he mentions in the Quran, Udu'uni astajib lakum. Call on me, ask from me, make dua to me. I accept your prayers. So we need to consistently and constantly ask Allah the Almighty whenever we are in need of something. So in this world, whenever someone comes to us and asks us to do a favor, then we get angry. We like it when no one comes to us and asks for a favor or no one comes to us and asks us for money. We like it that way. But Allah the Almighty is the opposite. He likes it when we ask Him and He gets angry when we don't ask Him. So we need to consistently and constantly ask Allah whenever we are in need of something. I pray Allah the Almighty give us the ability to ask Him as much as possible when we are in need of something. I pray Allah the Almighty give us the ability to make as much dua as possible.